installing System Manager, greater or equal to version 2.1, on a DVAR IP all in 1 5000 and 7000. In this video, we will show how to install System Manager 2.1 or later on a DVAR IP all in 1 5000 and 7000. This software enables it to connect the device to remote portal and allows for easy updating. As no form of software management is installed on these devices yet, the installation is slightly different compared to the newer DVAR IP all-in-one devices that support System Manager out of the box. We will follow these steps. 1. Download System Manager from the download store and unzip it to a USB storage device. 2. Install the software on the DVAR IP all-in-one. 3. Activate Super Doctor 5. 4. Check if the System Manager installation is operational. 1. Download System Manager from the download store and unzip it to a USB storage device. Open a browser and go to downloadstore.boshsecurity.com. Under the Software tab, select BVMS Appliances from the list. A list of all available software packages is displayed. Look for the latest package for System Manager. DVAR IP System Manager version 2.1.0. Download the file, System Manager 2.1.0 zip. Open the download location, and locate the downloaded file. Unzip the installation package. We use 7-zip for this, but the Windows built-in unzip software is also an option. Locate the folder that was unzipped, System Manager 2.1.0, and open it. Open the Bosch Appliance folder. Copy the file, System Manager X64 2.1.0 or later, to a USB storage device and plug it into the DVAR IP all in one. Two, install the software on the DVAR IP all in one. First, check the versions of your installed software to see if they are compatible with System Manager 2.1. Click the Windows menu, find and select Programs and Features. Check if the version for BVMS is greater or equal to version 11.1.1 and for VRM is greater or equal to version 4.03.0025. Locate the installation file on the USB storage device. Double click the file to start the installation. Read the license agreement, select the checkbox to accept it, and then click install to continue. Allow the installation process to make changes to the device by selecting yes. During the process, the Super Doctor service will be updated and its settings reset to defaults. If it is already configured and in use, make sure to back up the configuration first. Click install. The installation process may take a few minutes. Do not turn off the system or remove the USB storage device during the process. During the installation, a dialog box will be displayed showing the detected operation mode. Verify if this operation mode matches the intended use of this DVAR IP device. If a wrong operation mode is displayed, click Cancel to terminate the setup. In the Tools folder on the desktop, use one of the available batch files to change the operation mode and restart the installation process. If the operation mode is correct, select Next. The installation may take a few minutes. Do not turn off the system or remove the USB storage device during the process. 3. Activate Super Doctor 5. To activate the Super Doctor service, the Start SD5 service script must be run from the Tools folder on the Windows desktop. Open the File menu, select Open Windows PowerShell, and then select Open Windows PowerShell as Administrator. Then run the startup script for Super Doctor 5 by typing dot slash start SD5 service dot PS1. The startup script will run which starts the Super Doctor service, as well as sets it to load automatically on reboot of the device. 4. Check if the System Manager installation is operational. Start DVAR IP System Manager.
For details on how to connect to remote portal, watch our how-to video, Connecting a DVR IP to Bosch Remote Portal.